nice footwork, Tim. The uh, hands hold the club yep. and the feet grip the ground. I love it. And as I teach, the footwork is, is really not touched at all. And if yeah. you think about it, the only connection you have with the golf club is your hands, but most importantly, your feet to the ground. As I make my swing, you'll see how my weight's on the right hand of golf, mm -hmm. or my weight's inside part of my heel. Mm -hmm. As I make my back swing, my weight goes back to the inside part of the heel, but stays inside. You see a lot of golfers who slide in the back swing, yeah. and then they slide in the down swing. Yep. Your feet have to grip the ground, and if you lose that balance, that's going to cause inconsistency with the golf swing. You know, what we refer to a lot is foot function in the golf swing and also in yoga. In yoga, everything we do starts from the ground up, just like the golf swing. If you think about it, you set your feet at a dress, you feel the connection to the earth. For a lot of people, they experience weak arches or flat feet. And what that means really is it's an immediate kind of leak of energy from yes. the golf swing because we have to start from the ground up. So let me show you a couple exercises that you can do to help not only um, increase flexibility and strength in the feet, but also to create awareness of where your feet are and where your body is in space, which is the golf swing. Okay. So really the first thing we would do is just kind of step your left foot back. Now I have shoes on right now. You could even do this at home with you uh, in bare feet, right? So the first thing is to just come as high up onto your toes as you possibly can and then press your heel back. So we're getting it into the Achilles, right? And back here. So also in the address position, we need to be able to bend the knees and feel this what we call dorsiflexion of the ankles, right? Yes. So the first one is up and down with the feet, really feeling the action in the arches, okay? Then because we need to be able to feel both the inside and outside edges of the feet, I won't have you roll out because we don't want you to do that. Yes. We just showed that. But what I would do is just simply shift the hips side to side. You can even practice this with your eyes closed. Mm -hmm. And what that'll help you do is kind of have a sense of where your weight is distributed in the golf swing. All of these things to create more awareness of where your feet are. So it's all about having your feet Feet stay balanced, yes. stay centered, yes. and stay gripping the ground. Yes. So as I make my back swing, I get my feet are holding the ground. Yep. As I make my through swing, even though this right foot rolls, I'm still gripping the ground, correct? Absolutely. I'm always in balance, I'm always postured, I'm always breathing yes. as I make that swing. Yeah, and you just made a perfect point of when you turn, even though the foot is lifted, you are the heel is lifted, you are balanced, centered, focused. Bam.